Hello my dear students Welcome back to the English grammar classes number 9 Today we are going to learn about the compound noun in detail What is a compound noun? A compound noun is a noun made up of two or more words so when you hear about compound nouns always remember they are made up of two or more words examples examples well known here we have well known the first word here bedroom ice cream a six pack five year old sunny law snowball mailbox etc we can also divide the compound nouns into three types first closed or solid compound nouns what's a closed or compound what's a closed or solid compound noun Compound nouns are called closed or solid compound nouns when they are one word. Only one word, but it is a compound noun. Example, toothpaste, haircut, bedroom. So they are written together. They are not separate. That's why they are called solid ones the second division is hyphenated compound noun what is a hyphenated compound noun hyphenated compound nouns are those words that are connected by one or more hyphens we have a lot of examples for that like a sister-in-law mother-in-law jack in the box that's a toy for the children state of the earth brother-in-law shout out mindset five year old dry cleaning daughter-in-law and will be all these are examples for hyphenated compound noun so now we have the last division uh, of compound nouns that is open or spaced compound noun open or spaced compound nouns are those words that have space between and separated by the space there is no hyphen and they are not written together they are used as a single unit of meaning in spite of written separately as two words so they are written separately two words together and they make uh, one word examples we have here full moon roller coaster bus stop sleeping bag swimming pool here swimming pool please look at here first aid mud shot christmas tree christmas father christmas card etc so they are all compound nouns but they are open or spaced compound nouns when it said spaced we can understand it very easily now because there is space between two words now some more things to remember about the compound nouns first compound nouns can be made with two nouns two nouns are joined together and made one noun example taxpayer cell phone Hub teacher, rain board, money market, timetable, postcard, picture book, field glasses, engine driver, 
air ticket, crime novel, garden flowers, black board, servant maid, police officer, ice cream, firefighter, cricket ball, family business, hand bag, sunlight, toothpaste, foot for football, fish tank, summer nights. Now we have also compound nouns made with an adjective and a noun. So you are going to see some of the nouns, compound nouns here with adjective and noun. Examples forceful. So force is an abstractive noun and full is uh, a, an adjective. Ageless, homesick, uh, snow white, downward, harmless, accident prone, black gold, silk soft, merciless, picture perfect, honey sweet, milk white, red hot, full moon, blackboard. So look at them once more and observe these are all compound nouns with one adjective and one noun. One adjective and one noun. Together, they are one compound noun. Another way of making compound nouns is uh, with a verb and a noun. Compound nouns can be made with a verb and a noun. Examples, look at here. Snow draw, snow draw, air dash, tongue slip, bookmark, Headline, bus stop, time line, year mark, monthly pay, typewriter, telephone call, headache, moonlight, sunset, way lay, tie knot, bro beat. Lay break, tooth uh, ache, blood shed, uh, earthquake, root cause, root cause, back bite, cloud burst, bee sting, handshake, house arrest, washing machine, swimming pool see look at them how uh, how are they made they are made of one uh, noun and one verb so compound nouns can be made with a noun and a verb now another way of making compound noun is uh, noun plus gerund form example cat walking slow cycling air blowing cross heading ear piercing white car E, uh, examples cat walking slow cycling air blowing cross heading ear piercing white washing time consuming book binding account checking mountain trucking Bird watching, Eve T. 
dissing, freedom loving, house cleaning, thought provoking, etc. Now, another way of making compound noun is a compound noun uh, made of gerund plus noun. So, in, the, in this case, the gerund forms comes first, gerund form comes first, and then the noun is added. Examples sleeping room, walking day, rusting room, waiting hall, learning material, driving school, fishing net, starring hero, sitting bench. Now, compound nouns can be made with a verb and a preposition. Here we, I am just giving two examples here. Check out. Here, check is the verb and out is the preposition. Check up. So here, check again is the uh, verb and up is a preposition. Now, compound nouns can be made with a noun and a preposition. Example, over bridge. Inbox, off day, by line, under class, by path, outlaw, forethought, offspring, overcourt, afternoon, inside, middle man, downfall. Up, land, top hand, inmate, foresight, underground, underworld, bystander, onlooker. These are words for compound nouns made up with a noun and a preposition. Now, compound nouns can be made with a noun and a prepositional phrase. Example, mother-in-law. Here we have a prepositional phrase. Now, regarding the plural form of uh, compound nouns. When a compound noun is a single word, make it plural by adding s to the end. If the compound noun is hyphenated or composed of two separate words, remember to add S only to the word that is plural. Examples we have uh, one mother-in-law. When it is plural, you have to say two mothers-in-law. When you, If you say two laws, two mother-in-laws, it is wrong. But you have to say mothers in law. Another example, one director general, the plural of that, two directors general. You don't you cannot say two generals, but you can say you have to say you two directors general. So these are some of the details about the uh, compound noun. Hope that you had enjoyed the class and we will meet with another class uh, with uh, more interesting things i thank you very much for your attention thank you very much see you soon